Hey. Hi. Hi. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. No, I can. No, no, um, you, you didn't. Um, sorry, do we have a meeting scheduled? That I. I no, 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 no. I, I. Um, no. Oh. You're here to see Ivy. <laughs> Oh, my little Lambington, how did you get in my igloo? Hi, 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 hi. wake up. Oh, hi. hi. A dream. Oh, a wonderful dream. Oh, Dad. Oh, <laughs> sweetie, how are you? I'm good. Um, Someone told me you were going into town. Yeah, just heading up to Oregon. Oh, yeah, the, uh, the big fishing trip with yeah. Eric. We'll have dinner when I get back. Yeah, that'd be great. <sighs> you know, he's so excited to spend some time with you. If I, he'll ever get out of this meeting. And I'm excited about you, my little girl, a big-time jewelry designer, launching her own line in Europe. Yep. <laughs> Where's the first stop? Amsterdam. Oh, lots of bridges there. Watch your step. I know. I've got a game plan already. I'm just going to stick right down the center and avoid all the sides. Good plan. Unless this uh, Liam fella can jump in after <laughs> you. In which case, go for a swan dive. You're not getting dressed today? Oh, it just seems like a waste of time to me. What are you talking about? I mean, the clothes are just gonna end up on the floor. <laughs> well, it's part of the fun ripping your clothes off. Yeah, see, I've been meaning to talk to you about that. How many buttons am I supposed to lose? I mean, my, my very favorite t-shirt, it's in, in tatters, thanks to you. Oh, poor you. baby. <clears throat> Come here. No, 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 no. My the mind's face. on other things right now. Like what? Like Forrester Creations. And there you go. Completely out of the mood, thank you. Well, Wyatt told me that there's a shakeup going on down there. So what? Who cares? So our children work there. We have to make sure no matter what, they come out on top. Oh. Of course, Rick is upset. But he'll get over it eventually. It's if Maya ever gives him a moment alone. She's got her hooks in him. You have to get rid of her. <clears throat> A problem? There shouldn't be. If the three of you will focus on getting along. Rich, good. Come in. Sit down. Don't need to be here. I got other stuff. I got. Rich, I ask you to sit down. Will you sit down, please? Look, I call this meeting first and foremost to make an announcement, but before I do, I just want to remind everybody that this is a family business. I didn't work all these years to make this a successful fashion house, to have it fall apart because of the tension between two brothers. Now, I want you to work together. Designer and CEO. You gotta be kidding me. CEO drama at Forrester? Come on, Quinn, whatever happens, you know, it's gonna shake out fine for our kids. You think? Yeah, of course I do. I mean, Ridge and uh, Rick, they're smart guys, right? You know, they both recognize that Forrester needs hope for the future. I suppose. But let me guess, there's still something stressing you out. Oh, I thought Wyatt would have been able to convince Hope by now. Convince her of what? To stop excluding me. Will you give it time? I have given it plenty of time, and I am missing out on all sorts of grandmotherly duties. Like today, do you know what today is? It's their very first ultrasound. Oh, well, I mean, of course you would have been invited for that. Who says I need an invitation? It's so unwell. You know, I think Liam made quite the impression on you. Well, he'll never measure up to that McGuff boy, the though. <laughs> Dad, that was in the fifth grade. We didn't even hold hands. Ah, uh, well, I like the way he called me sir. Yeah, well, I didn't appreciate the way he, uh, he slurped his juice box, so that relationship was going nowhere. Ah, uh, Liam, on the other hand? Mm hmm <laughs> Well, my advice to you, young lady, don't give Liam a juice box any time <laughs> in the near future. Keep that magic alive as long as you can. So apparently there's a lot of action around here lately. You have no idea. Just a crazy amount. There's a there's a meeting going on right now, actually. Oh, uh, don't let me keep you. No, uh, oh, no, 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 I'm not going. Oh. Why? 
Just another appointment. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's rock and roll. It's uh, ultrasound time. So you're going on another fishing trip, hey? You know what, I don't think this is a, it's a very good look for Beverly Hills. Well, I'll be knee deep in the Rogue River before sundown. Picked up a few new flies on the way in. Oh, uh, very voila. good. You know what, I'm glad to hear that these are not gonna be used in the uh, forest to koi pond. Koi, oh no, too bony. I am taking my brother up to Oregon. Mm -hmm. In a couple hours, we'll be catching our dinner. If he ever finishes with this meeting, there's a lot happening at Forrester right now. Ah, I can still boss him around. Don't worry, he'll come. Oh, really? You think so? Well, if not, I'll invite Liam to join me. Mm. Get to know your gentleman caller a little better. Tell me, how fast can Liam gut a fish? You know what? I have no idea. Really? Well, how many dates have you had? Well, clearly, Dad, not enough. I just keep forgetting to ask that question. Well, look, if you ever need a chaperone to, you know, uh, steer the conversation around to... You know what? Thanks, but I think I'm going to be all right. With Liam, I think you will. Yeah. Ultrasound. Yeah. Hi. Yeah, it's our first one. Wow, that's... Yeah, it's a big day. You know, getting a look at our little bambino, or bambina. Right? <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, I saw Ivy out there, uh, you know, on reception. Oh, great. Oh, good. I, I was actually, I was hoping to see her, so. Well, I'm glad you're spending a lot of time with her. You know, she's very talented and she's very pretty and good for you. Uh, uh, but I think we ought to go. Mm-hmm. You know, we should probably. Yep. Okay, enjoy. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, we will. You're not seriously gonna do this. I have to. This is my grandchild we're talking about. You're gonna crash Hope's appointment. I am not missing anything in my grandchild's life, despite what Hope says. Come on, wish me luck. You're gonna need it. Look, this is really, really important. Our company is depending on all of you to and get my this. my stomach's depending on you getting a move on. What the heck is taking so long in here? John, will you just give me a few minutes, all right, please? Hey, excuse me, everyone. Eric and I are flying up to Oregon and fishing for our own dinner. Come on, Eric. They're starting to bite right now. I can feel it. Look, I'm afraid you're going to have to go without me, John. I've got so much to handle here. Didn't you just name a new CEO? Yes, he did. Rick. And why did you do that? So you could attend boring meetings or so you could jump on a plane with your brother? Come on, you suckered Rick into taking the job. Let him do it. Incidentally, congratulations, Rick. You're going to do a great job. Thank you. Dad, go. We'll be fine. Not the company I worry about so much. It's you. It's you and Rich. We'll work it out. They'll work it out! Come on, Eric. Sundown is fast approaching. You're going to love the guys, the sound of crackling wood, that little tavern in Shady Cove. Incidentally, they call it Shady Cove for a reason. <laughs> is that still at the memory? Have a great trip, Dad. He is there. Well, Dad's gone fishing. Some well-deserved R&R. &R. Does anyone else uh, need a little break? There's the door. I'm not gonna judge. Might wanna think about it because things aren't gonna be easy around here for any one of you. Because as far as I'm concerned, you've all betrayed me. You, I'd like some worthwhile designs. And if you need to hold her hand to do it, that's fine. I don't care. And you, you'll be hearing from my attorney. As an attorney, I strongly suggest a cooling off period. You've always been loyal to Ridge. That better change if you want to stay around here. I'm loyal to Forrester Creations. And I'd like to advise you legally to be very careful about the decisions you make. Maya's all over you. She's a money grubbing. One bad word against her, you're gone. 
Maya is the only one who's actually been truthful to me. And if anyone has a problem with Maya or me, I suggest you get the hell out. Because there is no place for you here at Forrester Creations. So really, that's, that's what you're doing? You're gonna throw your weight around? If you don't like it, don't let the door hit you. Can we please just talk, just the two of us alone? No. Hey, I have an idea. I got her into this. Don't take it out on her. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, I'm just suggesting maybe you should talk to your wife. I don't care what any of you think. Except for our new lead model. Lead? Oh, God. Caroline, I'd like you to get to work on a dress for Maya, the showstopper. We've already designed a showstopper. Yeah, it's pretty basic, actually. I really want something that showcases Maya's beauty. No. Excuse me? You're just rubbing this in my face. You're trying to make it as painful as possible. This is your job. It was a few kisses. That is it, and I know that it was wrong. But you're seriously losing it. You're latching yourself onto Maya? You are hurt, and you are upset, and you are angry. But this is no way to handle it. It is not too late for us. I am not giving up on our marriage. This meeting is over. Wait, can we just please? Leave. All of you. Good that you stood up to them. I'm CEO. They'll learn to respect that. They already are. Can I get a moment alone? Okay. I'm proud of you. Yeah, what, what exactly are we going to see? You know? Not much at this point. Ah. It's too soon to tell whether it's a boy or a girl, if that's what you're asking. OK, so no rush then, right? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe at the next appointment. Okay. Now, make sure to tell me whether you want me to keep it secret. Uh, I don't know. I think we have to talk about it. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I wish Rick could see the mistake he's making taking this out on you. Thank you for what you did in there. Sticking up for me. It's the truth. It's my fault. No. It's it's both our faults. Like I just got caught up in you. But designing. He's leaving me. He's hooking up with Maya. What am I supposed to do? Ready for visitors? Sure. Settling in, isn't it? The job is really yours. Yeah. What's in the bag? Well, we never properly celebrated. So, champagne and caviar. Whoa, mm -hmm. my favorite. <laughs> Your CEO, I'm lead model. If ever there were a time to celebrate, it's now. Should I open the champagne? Please. All right. Uh, wait. 
I just want you to know, you'll forget her. In time. You will. If you just focus on us. Now pop that cork. All right. Read my mind. <laughs> Watch out. There. Tess. Turning back, tell yourself to move on, make your heart switch tracks. I know you've chosen a different path when you lost your faith in me. Another man gave you everything. More reasons to. I did, I'd be a fool. 